Good morning, guys. Captain Dylan Hubbard here at Hubbard's Marina with a sunrise view inside John's Pass. We got all our Pelican friends hanging out this morning because there's nothing going on. Unfortunately, no fishing going on this morning due to this weather. We have some pretty seriously bumpy conditions near shore and unfortunately offshore today. Uh, and that bumpy condition is gonna last through the day today, near shore and offshore. Uh, however, it will calm down nicely for us tomorrow. So tomorrow is looking much better. And then Wednesday, Thursday, all look really, really good. So if you wanna get out in the water, you definitely wanna make sure you book or plan for getting out on the water for Wednesday and Thursday or Tuesday afternoon because that weather looks like it's gonna get good there for just a little bit and then we might see another big storm this weekend sometime Friday afternoon. We're hoping that changes because we have a lot of plans on the water this weekend with Easter coming up. We've got a 44 hour trip and some other trips this weekend that we definitely wanna try to get offshore. However, we unfortunately have to work with the weather not against it and uh, we will be paying close attention so if you have a weekend trip with booked with us here at Hubbard's Marina I would recommend you just hang on and we'll definitely be communicating about the weather in the next day or two uh, but gorgeous little mid section of the week being Tuesday afternoon Wednesday and Thursday so little reprieve from that weather we do have a super light 39 hour trip going out Tuesday if you want to join us for that uh, but gorgeous views inside John's Pass. The good thing about this bad weather, guys, is it's nice and chilly today. It is uh, in the low 70s, high 60s in most of the area. So just a gorgeous morning this morning. No humidity whatsoever. And on the way to work, it was about 68 degrees. It's warmed up now to the low 70s. So really really nice temperature this morning and uh great to be outside and enjoy these beautiful views plus we have great shelling uh, i know most of you guys like uh following us because of our fishing but if you do like our shelling trips this bad weather does push some crazy awesome shelling opportunities for example we got a lot of shark's teeth down at shell key and egmont key Great opportunity this week to join us for our Shell Key or Egmont Key Ferries. Oh, look at that. Osprey. That's cool. Don't see one of those every morning. Got an Osprey cruising through the shot. But uh, like I was saying, great opportunities down at Shell Key and Egmont Key right now to uh, go out and get some great shells and shark's teeth. Uh, and then during Tuesday afternoon, Wednesday and Thursday, great opportunities to get out there and do some fishing. Our five hour half day, we're still catching a lot of those kingfish and mackerel. Uh, on our 10 hour trips, you have a great shot at some kingfish and mackerel too. And then you have a decent shot at some hogfish, maybe a mangrove, but mostly right now, we're catching a lot of those lane snapper, vermilions, grays, porgies, sea bass. Having a lot of action, and we're having a little bit of quality mixed in there too. And then, uh, Wednesday, we have our 12-hour extreme trip going out. Great weather, or uh, decent weather for that. Looks about two and a half, three foot. So a little bumpy, but not bad. Definitely planning on going on that 12-hour extreme trip. So looking forward to that. And then uh, we got our Tuesday 39-hour trip. We got plenty of private charter options as well. And then this weekend... Hopefully this weather is going to change. If it does not change, then we're going to be uh, probably having to change some of our plans for the weekend. But it should bring some really, really good shelling on the backside of that big storm. Plus, the fishing should be really, really good on Wednesday and Thursday ahead of that big cold front approaching. So definitely looking forward to the little midweek period here and trying to capitalize on some of that great fishing. We also have the snook coming back into the passes and getting out on the beaches there. Great time to go get some snook around John's Pass Jetty, John's Pass Bridge, and Madeira Beach. And then awesome opportunities uh, for some pompano, especially this time of morning. 
in the beginning of the morning as the sun rises or near sunset that uh, pompano bite seems to pick up a little bit. First couple hours of the day is really my favorite time to go target those pompano along the jetty with the docks jig or the live shrimp or a sand flea or a fiddler crab right along the bottom. Those pompano cruise the sandy bottoms, that sandy trough running parallel to the beach or those sandy drop-offs right along the side of the jetty. So great opportunity to get out there and do some fishing. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this beautiful sunrise view with us here inside John's Pass. Normally I'm a little too busy to sit here and film the whole sunrise, but I figured I got here just in time to see the whole thing. So I figured I might as well share it with you guys. It's definitely a great way to start the day, hanging out here with the Pelicans and uh, enjoying the still gorgeous weather we have this morning and watching that beautiful sunrise here inside fish famous john's pass hopefully y'all can get a chance to come out and join us during this uh really nice weather we have during the middle of this week tuesday afternoon wednesday thursday look awesome hopefully you guys have some great plans for this uh easter weekend and uh hopefully some of y'all enjoyed that live stream show last night I know I did. Remember, next weekend, our live stream show is canceled due to Easter. We will resume that the Sunday after Easter. But time for me to get to work, guys. Hopefully, you all enjoyed the view and uh, this morning video. We hope to see you sometime inside John's Pass at Hubbard's Marina. Gorgeous day. Gorgeous weather here. I know most, or not most, but... A large portion of the country is still enjoying the snow right now. We're here inside Johns Pass. It's mid-70s and sunny today. So definitely blessed to be living in paradise. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the view. Have a great day. And uh, remember, if you're too busy to go fishing, you're just too darn busy.